Hey guys, Jane Ass here. What is up, guys? This is a uh, double intro. Somebody complained about my double intro, saying I need to change it. What do you guys think? Uh, tell me if I need to change it or just keep it. I kind of like the dub, double intro, because I get double Moabs all the time. No, seriously. But here's a triple for your face, bitch. But um, this is a double Moab with a G36. I'm going to continue that little series I'm doing with uh, a double Moab with every assault rifle. So I got the M4A1 with the double, the ACR. I don't think I've gotten one with the SCAR, I've gotten one with the G36 and the FAD. So I got a couple more assault rifles and then I'll move on to some machine guns. I already got the MP7 out of the way and the PP90 and the P90. So I got all the hard uh, some machine guns. I think I can do it. I've been really close with the PM9. Uh, I think I got one Moab and then like a 17-18 gun trick. So I'm, I'm getting there. I'll be I'll be there in no time. So anyways guys, in this commentary I guess you guys can say, I just want to I just want to talk about some tips for Bacara and uh, some like a better I don't know I'll just I'll go with the flow here so I'll do tips first so the first tip I can give you guys with Bakara the spawns are very 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 bad they spawn all over the place you can be uh, one person can push a spawn and they will flip instantly and one little tip is that opposite of B flag you know over here the buildings to the right that little uh, hallway I guess you could say uh, if they have C flag they love to camp in there so I, I try to recommend capping C flag and uh, trapping him that A because C flag is they either camp in that building or if they actually run out it's really easy pickings but uh, usually people just camp up here and I don't I don't really like it because it's really fucking hard to get them out so I'd rather them spawn at A and I find it easy to pick them off at A but the one problem with this map is it's really hard to control the, the spawns no matter what you do uh, if one person push, pushes too far they're gonna be spawning all over the place so um, Bakara is not one of my, my best maps, my favorite maps. It's really hard for Assault on this map. I don't know why. It might be because the spawns are so shit. But I think the most kills I got with Assault on this on this map is like 93, 94. Like nothing nothing over 100. So um, I think it's just because it's such a big map. Such long lines of sight. It's easy to get picked off by snipers. But that's just my opinion. And for tips for Bakara, if they're capping B and they have C, like they do right here, they're going to spawn right where I just looked in that little uh, spot you can you can say in that corner. What I like to do is I like to patrol that tunnel um, by B flag and run back and forth, back and forth. And it, it is really easy to pick off kills. Usually, I don't even think a lot of people even know about that hallway behind B. Um, especially the newbie year players, they, they'll have no fucking clue. So you can easy pick them off, and that's how I usually get a bunch of pay blows. Is when they actually have C and B flag, because I just run through that hallway back and forth. And... In this game, it's really necessary to make loops around the map, or loops around the spawn system. And I just make a giant circle, um, like right here. This is what I come come through this tunnel, go back and forth, back and forth. It's like a little loop, like a little um, circle, I guess you guys could say. And that's the real trick to kill whoring, is you got to find where they're spawning and then just make laps around the spawn system. And that's the best method, I guess you can say. And as you guys saw, that guy was coming around the corner. I knew he was. So I jumped and then um, drop shot. So that's just another tip. If you know guys coming around the corner, jump and then instant drop shot. There's no way in hell they're going to make it. But in this gameplay, I just want to talk about something with the G36. It's not the best gun up close. It is a fairly good uh, assault rifle. The iron sights are a little iffy. There is actually a little bit of recoil that I don't like on this gun. It goes up a little. And with the iron sights, it makes it kind of difficult, uh, but not really, not too bad. But G36 is a pretty good gun. Uh, it's probably the fourth best assault rifle, fifth best assault rifle. It depends on it, if you like the AK-47 or not. So um, I, in this gameplay, I really didn't play like my usual play style where I'm going balls deep, I guess you could say. I played really defensive and just played really smart. And that's the trick to getting Moabs and double Moabs. If you want to get a double Moab, and you say you can get a Moab all the time, but you struggle for that double. And what I've noticed when going for the triple, I go, man, I die so many times on 20 gun streaks all the time when I'm going for triples because I have to rush constantly. And I have to be, I, ha I just have to kill for it to the max. And with double Moabs, you can take your time. Games average about 9 minutes. So a 4 minute Moab and another 4 minute Moab. And you got yourself a double Moab. Uh, what I like to generally do for these doubles is I like to get the first one fairly quick. And then if I know I'm going to go for the second one or I can only get the second one, I'll slow my game down. I'll slow I'll slow it down just in general and just play super smart and super defensive. And that's really all it is. It's not Double Moabs are nothing hard anymore. Um, triples are very hard because you have to rush the entire time. Uh, you got to generally get all your Moabs around three minutes exactly or less. So... 
just get the first Moab. Say you get a first Moab fairly quickly, kill yourself instantly, and then just play pretty good. Pr play smart. Play like you know how to. Um, hopefully, you have a good understanding of the spawns. And if you still don't have a good understanding of the spawns, I might be able to do something. I I don't know. Like I wish I was good at like uh, what is it, Photoshop or whatever, so I can make every single spawn system like all the like red squares, hot spots. I guess you could say on the maps. My voice just cracked a little bit, and I feel feel like a child. But um. I think that would really help you guys out if you knew where exactly they spawn on the map at every spawn point, A, B, and C flag. I'll try to do that. Um, if you can help me with, help me do that, um, send me a message on Twitter, DM. I'd, I'd appreciate it if you're really good with Photoshop and you can get the maps, um, like the, the little map when you hit the back button and the UAV goes off or something like that. That would really help me out. So message me on Twitter if you can do that. And also, guys, before I go, I just want to say I'm going to be live streaming for about six hours from two to eight, I'm gonna have a huge delay on my stream, like five, six minutes, so I'll get absolutely no session joiners. And I think I'll be able to pull out a triple, maybe a quad. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. But um, I'll put that link in the description. I'll probably upload a video. I'm gonna try to start around 2:15, 2:30 uh, Central Time. So um, this video will be going up at one, so about an hour to an hour and a half later. So make sure to come into the stream. I'll put the link in the description. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. This is Jay Motherfucking Nasty. Peace out, sluts. Uh, yeah, make sure to come to the stream. It's gonna be epic. I'm I'm calling it multiple triples, multiple triples. See you guys later. Peaches, peaches, motherfucker, titty.